Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having the best day ever. Vlogmas day six. We're at it today. And for today's video, we're gonna do something a little different. We're gonna do a battle of the cream bronzers. This is the Fenty Beauty Cream Bronzer and this is the Elf Putty Bronzer. I love both of these, but I'm gonna put them to the test today and see which one is truly better. I have two clean brushes right here that are pretty similar and I'm gonna put the Fenty Bronzer on this side of my face and the Elf Bronzer on this side of my face. Okay, I am going to start off with the Fenty Cream Bronzer and I'm gonna do that on this side of my face. So I'm just gonna start off by going in and putting some on the brush. It's a little bit far on the back, so I'm gonna get a little bit more product on the front as well. And I'm just going to stamp that on where I would normally put my contour. Okay, that is what this side is looking like so far. Now let's go ahead and dip into the e.l.f. Putty Bronzer. I'm almost out, I need to get a new one, but I have enough for now. Same thing, I'm just gonna put it where I would normally put my contour and blend it out. My foundation was already a little bit too dark today. This bronzer is definitely making it even darker. Not just this one, both of them. Okay, so we have the e.l.f. bronzer on this side and the Fenty bronzer on this side. I don't know which one I'm liking better right now. They look very similar to me. Um, I think the only difference is this one seems to be a little bit warmer if I'm not mistaken. Maybe it's just darker and needs blended more. It looks warmer though. But see, the problem with that is this looks so cool toned, I feel like in the, not really, I guess. No, it doesn't. <laughs> I take it back. Wrong brush. Ooh, it's okay. It's fine, it's fine. I barely touched my face. They're looking so similar to me. Hmm. Both of the bronzers look very similar to me. This one is looking a little bit more harsh in my opinion, and maybe I used too much, but this side seems to have blended a little bit more effortlessly and look a little bit more seamless in my opinion. Um, let me see if I can clean this side up with some concealer and see if that makes it any better. Okay, upon further inspection, I definitely think this side blended easier because I'm noticing I'm having to go back in on this side and touch up some spots that need some extra love. I just touched up the forehead because the forehead was looking a little wacky, but this side, I feel like it just blended so seamlessly and easy. I was done in like 30 seconds. I'm gonna go ahead and finish the rest of my face and I will be back with my final thoughts. Okay, I am back to give my final thoughts on the battle of the bronzers. It took me a second to come to a conclusion, but I have decided the winner. And the winner is, drum roll please, the Elf Putty Bronzer. And my reasoning for that being is this is still a great product. I will show you both sides. This is the Fenty Cream Bronzer side, and this is the e.l.f. Putty Bronzer side. This is what I will say. Both products are amazing and do an amazing job. However, if we are looking at price point, product, oops. Okay, we're back. 
However, if we are looking at price point, product, time spent, blending the product, et cetera, et cetera, if you break down all of those things, this one is more expensive and I did have to spend a little bit more time blending it and making sure that it looked seamless. Whereas this one seemed to just blend effortlessly. It didn't take any time at all. It was like the product did all the work for me. So that is why I picked this one to be the winner today because it has a much lower price point than this one as well as just the time spent blending, um, this one took longer. So we got to give this one a win. It is a dub. It's taken home the gold. <laughs> okay, so that completes this battle of the bronzers. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was so much fun to make and I will see you here later.